Now, the other great mile and a half race for three-year-olds was run this morning, the Belmont Stakes uh, in America. Thunder Golsh is in second placing at the moment. He won the Kentucky Derby at 25 to 1. He then ran a terrific race in the Preakness Stakes, which is the second leg of the Triple Crown, when he ran third behind Timber Country. Now, he's sitting outside uh, Star Standard at the moment. You notice Star Standard here, Keith, it runs him off the track just about. And Thunder Golsh, who... Uh, the Triple Crown in America is the Kentucky Derby over 10 furlongs, then the Preakness over 9, and then the Belmont over 12. And see, he runs him off the track, Star Standard, but Thunder Golsh able to win. And Wayne Lucas, the trainer of this horse, has produced a remarkable feat, hasn't he? Five successive uh, legs of uh, the Triple Crown, Bruce. Not uh, with different horses this year. This uh, horse won two of them. And Timber and Country in the middle. Timber Country in the middle. Um, run on dirt, as you can see, and obviously another very good horse. Let's hear the closing stages. So there you have Thunder Golsh and uh, Lamb Tarn of the Big... And in England too, uh, Frankie Dottori won uh, on Moonshell, won the Oaks. So he was runner-up in the derby. He went very close uh, to a classic double. And the other big vintage crop won during the week. And Celtic Swing, the super horse, went to France and won the derby there. Great. Worldwide racing. Yeah, terrific. Thanks, Keith. Keith catch you next week. Sure. Speaking of worldwide, French Open after this, John Alexander. Then we hope to go to Paris to talk to a very special guest.